Step 1. Transfer Windows OS to the SSD. If you decide to keep using your original OS, then you surely need to transfer your old system to your new SSD. If you have no idea about transferring OS, this software can help you out. Next, I'll show you how to transfer OS with AOMI Partition Assistant Pro Edition. If you find it useful, you can hit the link in the description to download it. Launch AOMI Partition Assistant. Click Clone tab and Migrate OS. Select the SSD here as the target disk. Check the option. Resize the system partition on the target disk if you need. Here is a note that may be useful later. Back to the main interface. Then click apply to execute the pending operations. Step 2. Set the boot device. Enter BIOS while booting and set the SSD as the primary boot device, then you can run the OS on new SSD successfully. Step 3. Delete the old hard drive. If you still want to make full use of your old hard drive, you have the option to delete or format it, which will remove the old operating system and unnecessary files. This operation can free up storage space and potentially improve your overall system performance. AOMI Partition Assistant can also help you with this. Right-click your old hard drive and choose the Delete All Partitions option. Select the deleting method. Then back to the interface and click Apply and proceed, in turn to commit the operations. Besides, if you decide to sell the old drive or just drop it, you can right-click on the disk partition and select Wipe Partition, so your data will be impossible to recover by others. Choose a way that suits you best and click OK, click Apply, and proceed to execute it. AOME Partition Assistant is all-in-one disk management that can help you clone disks, convert disks, free up disks, recover disks, wipe disks, and more. Simply hit the link in the description to download the free version of AOME Partition Assistant. You could consider upgrading to its Pro Edition according to your needs. Thanks for watching till here. I'll see you in the next two videos. And don't forget to subscribe to us. If you have any questions or issues please leave comments or email us.